Hey guys, so I got a message from a subscriber asking to see a uh, beer test with the OnePlus 3T phone. Uh, so I wanted to uh, check it out here. We're going to freeze it for 10 hours in uh, some very nice uh, beer here, premium Belgian, uh, which we do enjoy. And we do have the 3T, as you can see. This is the uh, latest uh, model here from uh, OnePlus and uh, you can see this is the gray kind of color so uh, we're going to try and do this i really don't think it's going to survive to be honest because it's not officially uh, a waterproof phone but uh, it is interesting you know these phones do have to be tested now and again uh, so we're going to first crack open the beer uh, so we do have uh, one key there to stop it from moving and uh, let's just get this open so uh, do we have, uh, how do we open this? So it looks like uh, this one is needing a beer opener, which uh, is nice. As you can see, whoops, nice. Uh, so let's just pour this one in. We're going to tip it nice and slow. Oh, very nice. Look at that froth. Uh, we do have another one here, so just going to pour this one in, crack it open. Nice. I'll save this for later, I think. A little tipple for the weekend. Oh, he's coming to the top. I'll let that froth die down a little bit. <laughs> that is pretty nice. Sun's out as well. Oh, we're getting there. We're getting there. And I think uh, we are there, pretty much. Nice. Uh, so let's just put these to the side. And uh, let's uh, close it up here. Uh, so you can see the screen is still on. I can see something on the screen. Uh, can we just prove that? You can see, which is nice. Uh, we're going to seal it up here. And then we're gonna make our way to the freezer, the freezer of doom. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, lift everything up. So up we go. Let's get it here. Oh, that's heavy. And uh, into the kitchen we go. And let's just put it on its side here. As you can see, the screen is still on, uh, which is nice. And I am putting it in with uh, some beef burgers, etc. And we're going to shut the freezer. We're going to go back to the table. And on the table, we do have mate nine. And we're going to time now for 10 hours. So, yeah, I will see you later. And I think it's time here. It is time to check out the OnePlus 3T. So we're going to disactivate that and have a look here, see uh, what we've got. 10 hours later, let's uh, go into the freezer and open it up. Oh, so I think we have some lager in the freezer. And this is the, the jar here. And we're just going to put that down there, as you can see. Uh, so it looks pretty frozen here. You know, there's some liquid at the bottom, but oh, look at that. That is pretty nice. Uh, so it's getting nice and frothy here. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to put my camera on a tripod and we're going to check it out, see if we can get the phone out. 
uh, you know, place your bets. Do you think that the phone has survived? I really don't. Uh, but it will be interesting to see, nevertheless. So, as you can see, we do have uh, a nice uh, frothy uh, kind of uh, beer keg here. And uh, it has already begun to melt, so it might not actually need too much uh, hot water. So we have got some hot water ready though, just in case. And we're going to see if we can have a look here what we've got. So you can see we do have uh, some nice icicles here. And uh, let's see. Oh, frozen Stella. That was a bit messy. Ah, so you can see it's actually quite easy to get out today. Uh, so no uh, digging here. And uh, this is the device. Uh, does it work? That is the million dollar question. Uh, so we're going to press the power button. Ooh. So nothing is happening here. I am pressing it. It looks like it is doomed. At last. Ducky has had some blood. I mean, look at that. That uh, is completely wet here. Let's just try and... Uh, kind of dry it off here because <laughs> that might help a little bit with the actual uh, usability of the phone I mean so far it's looking like a bad idea to freeze your OnePlus phone I mean it's an amazing phone overall but you know uh, I think uh, it's not officially waterproof uh, which you know could be something to consider for the next one but we do have a charger here maybe it's just run out of battery or something because sometimes that is the case sometimes they come back to life after a couple of weeks but it is really kind of wet through here and you know that uh, goes to show you really we do want waterproof now when it comes to high-end phones uh, so that wasn't good it's quite slippy as well actually so let's just get this thing really dry here old OnePlus 3T I barely knew you you know and I was gonna make this one my daily driver but uh, I decided to freeze it to death anyway <laughs> uh, so where is my Chotec? good old Chotec can revive anything back from the dead here we go let's see so let's uh, power this on and let's go no Oh, it's dead, bro. It is dead. Oh, my God. One plus three. You've let me down. Oh, dear. So you can see this phone does not like the uh, the beer here. Maybe it's a wine person. Uh, you can see. Oh, it's not on. Hang on. Let's just turn it on. So, yeah, it's definitely on here. Or maybe it will become one of those zombie phones which come back from the dead. Who knows? I'll put it in some rice, I think. And uh, hope for the best. If not, it's a good excuse to get one of the black uh, OnePlus 3Ts, which is available now. I think they call it Colette 1. Uh, so rest in peace. You know, rest in peace here, OnePlus 3T. I did enjoy you. I'm going to have to go back to <laughs> OnePlus 3. Uh, so don't freeze your phone, you know, don't freeze your OnePlus 3 uh, and uh, it might survive a water test because we did do a water test but the freezing seems to 
uh, make for a phone which is completely inebriated here uh, so yeah uh, just a quick little video here hope you did enjoy and I'll be doing some other videos uh, very shortly we should be getting some new phones in uh, as well not too long now to the S8 and Z5 oh sorry XZ premium should I say uh, so very excited for those and obviously there will be a OnePlus uh, successor as well coming shortly hopefully uh, so yeah, just a quick video here and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.